I got here in the first practice, I was like, wow, man, these girls can really sing. Yeah. You know, and, and, and Eric too, you know, he didn't sing right away, you know. He was just doing backgrounds and I said, hey, let's hear you do one of these songs. Yeah. And uh, it was great too. The kick of the jazz is a great capper. Yeah, yeah, uh, that's, I that's know. great. I know. Well, I, I love that song. You yeah, know, like, MC5. Oh yeah, I saw them play it live several really, times. Yeah? yeah, yeah. Well, we were label mates, so yeah, yeah, yeah. We were supposed to play with them, but it didn't happen. And you know, and then the next thing they broke up. By the time we were like touring, it, yeah. well, we were Wait. on Electra, and then we got dropped. What year? What was that? That was, but that was in '68. '68. Wow. Yeah. And we were dropped in 1970. Yeah, yeah. And then it took us another year to get a, a record deal in '71, and you know. They uh, would play with Iggy, and then what I think they broke up in like 70, Stooges 73. And and we played with Iggy a lot. You guys played a lot of people, didn't you? Oh, yeah. A lot, a lot. I mean, yeah, a lot Hendrix of people's and careers are kind of threatened. Muddy Waters, years. and, oh, you yeah. know, I mean, people you wouldn't even imagine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Weather Report. Weather <laughs> Report? Oh, yeah. Mahavishnu. No man. way. Yeah. Yeah, a lot of wow. jazz people to wow. play with, you know. It was Stevie Wonder. You know, st- Chaka Khan, things you wouldn't imagine. You know, back in those days, people really were very creative with their booking. And, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, and yeah, was, you'd have Miles Davis and. Uh, you know, I have to say, I think that the record business is doing very well, uh, even though the record companies themselves are not doing yeah, so yeah, well. Yeah, yeah. But the quality of music is staying right up there. But I just think I had an opportunity that most. Young bands don't have, for sure. Yeah, you know, you know, to play with just a really diversified group, you know, and yeah, I'm still having that. That's awesome. Really you still, yeah, still squeezing the juice out of the yeah, 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 <laughs> That's yeah. great. Yeah, because you got yeah, back in that day, like yeah, yeah, it was, you know, it was great. It was really a great time. You know? And uh, you know, it's. I mean, there's still that world doesn't exist anymore. You know, you really, get an advance you know, and they. I mean, we, we put out three records that didn't really sell that much. Yeah. They sold, they made their money back because we made them cheaply, but, yeah. you know, they weren't hits by any means. Right. And it wasn't until our fifth record that we had a hit. So, I yeah. mean, nowadays, if you don't have a hit on your first record, they drop you. Yeah, exactly. You know, yeah, so, yeah. It's a different, it's changing so, now, right? But, it's, you know, so you got to do it the way that we did it, you know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Work your way up, play it live, like these Dean Liqueur guys are doing, you know. They're great, eh? Yeah, they're and they're young and they're great. You know, I think they're going to be very successful. Oh, yeah. Yeah. For sure. Oh, it's great. Oh, great. Thanks. What a pleasure, man. Yeah, it's yeah. Awesome. Yeah. Uh, like I said, great band. Every every one of them was great. Oh, oh yeah. And it's hot out there. Yeah, and it's hot. Yeah. Yeah, yeah it was for sure. And so were you guys. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> That was awesome, Albert. Thanks, dude. It was a pleasure, man.